Hola. Where I go on that girl? Where I go on my yacht? Everybody in the club, hope y'all open your blues, nigga. Pop that cat. Hola, como estas? What's up, y'all? So for this video, I'm gonna show y'all how to create custom AOs. But if you also wanna buy just a pre-made AO, cause you don't really feel like creating your AO. A lot of y'all was asking me in my previous video, oh, where I buy an AO? Where do you get your AO from? I got you right now. So stay tuned. Make sure you guys like and subscribe. Show me some love. I really appreciate it. I do read all you guys' comments when y'all leave me a comment. So if you wanna. Leave me a comment if you got a question. Feel free to leave your comment below. My Instagram, my main Instagram is Damien underscore Joseph. My gaming page is Poppy Finesse. And I always forget to add my second life. My second life name is Poppy Finesse. So if you want to add me on there, you want to be friends, you want to be cool, feel free. <laughs> but yeah, let's get right into the video. Okay, so we are at Kuso Oracle Animation. So this is actually one location. That you can buy animation overriders or buy like AOs and stuff like that. So we can go to Oracle AO. So you click that button on that teleporter thing, and then it will take you to Oracle. So I'll probably go back to see what the other locations are. If you have a female avatar, you could go right over here. And they have all the poses, animations, stuff like that. So what you would do is, I'll show y'all an example. Even though my avatar is not a female, this is for example purposes. So you would just click it, demo, and then show you all the walks. So say if you like this walk, you would buy it. You like this walk you like all this walks if you like this setting you buy it so this is how you would set up your own custom AO so what you would do is you would buy like poses one by one like that but if you want to buy the AO and you just feeling lazy you could just buy the whole thing by clicking on the image right there and that's how you buy the whole animation overrider so if I go over here I'm sorry uh, I actually had to fix my key binding settings cuz I had deleted this off my laptop because I was having troubles logging in so I just realized I had to actually reset my toolbar and reset my key bindings and settings and all that stuff so I'm back on track with everything and I actually make another key binding video and it would actually be like a speed walkthrough versus my other one but if you want the whole walkthrough um i have a previous video on that so yeah so if you want the male animation overrides you would click right over here and as you did on the female one you would just pose whichever one you want you buy it pay but i'm not gonna buy one right now until after i show you guys a few of the stores so yeah here are some examples of a walk I don't know why my avatar is so um dark and that's another thing I actually have to buy my run lights again or redownload them but here's a jump here's another walk crouch I believe a typing animation so yeah, whichever one you like, you just buy it and buy multiple. So you will buy like a few stands. You will buy a fallen one. You will buy pretty much everything you need. Walk, run, fly, etc. Whatever. So that's one location you could go to, which is Kuso Oracle Animation. And I believe if you walk around outside of the store, you will see a whole bunch of other stores you could walk into with more animation so you have one over here i believe it's one over there but that's kind of too far so i'm not going all the way over there 
let's actually run to be honest because I'm tired of walking we are tired of walking so we're gonna have to just run so oh yeah actually the animation or the AL that I'm using I brought I will show you guys where I brought mines from I didn't put this one together cuz like I said I'm lazy <laughs> and that's a lot of work but yeah so if you want more poses here's some more in this store I see a lot of female overriders so I feel like second life I feel like the female avatars be having a whole bunch of options when it comes to a lot of things such as hair, clothes, all that stuff, and males. Keep it real simple, which I actually prefer. I like stuff to be real simple. But if you wanted a male animation override, you will come over here. So this is one. Actually, this is the second store. And like I said, oh, that's a window. <laughs> if y'all wanted to um, just walk around, you could see is more stores over there it's actually poses right there like I said that's way too far <laughs> and we have more AOs over there so this is one store so let's go to another store so this is actually where I brought my animation overrider from I actually like this one So yeah, you have female poses right over here. Female poses. And whichever one you like, you just click it and buy it. Let's try this one. So this is a set. I actually like this set. Yeah, this is the animations. There's some more animations. I really forgot which one I have. Let's see. I'm sorry, I forgot which animation I got. I was trying to show y'all, but I don't remember which one I got. Oh yeah, so this is another location. If you want to go ahead and buy pre-made animation overriders or AO. Here's a kid AO. I should actually check this one out for my child avatar. Oh yeah, so this is where you would come to buy an AO. And I'm sure there's more stores around, but those are the only two that I know at the moment. I'll check. Oh yeah, it took me to the same spot. But yeah, you just will have to find a store that you like. Like I said, there's more stores around. And just if you want to buy the pre-made whole avatar you would click it pay i'm not gonna pay right now it's kind of expensive <laughs> but if you want to be lazy you want to buy everything have about 2000 linda on you or if you just want to get a custom one so if you go to kuso it's actually cheaper than here but i honestly prefer the animations at this location so now that we got that out the way, I'm going to show you guys how to create your own. Okay, so I'm back at Kuso Oracle Animation. So what you want to do before you start creating your own animation overrider or AO is you want to go over here. And you want to buy an MD Oracle Animation HUD. Because that's what you will use to get all your poses and insert all your poses into this HUD and then you created your own custom AL. So I'm going to buy this. And I'm going to go ahead and buy a few poses for my avatar. So let's see. 
and I'm just gonna be really random with it so whichever one you like like I said go ahead and buy that one so I buy I buy this walk. I buy this running one. I buy this crouch. Type in one. I'm not sure if I brought a running one. I forgot that quick. Let's go, man. Buy the standing one, then I'll buy a running one just in case if I did not buy a running one. So, yeah, once you buy all roses, then you will go to your house or wherever you like to go to res your items, and then you would insert it. So I'll show you guys how to do that. So here's my animation HUD. So what you gotta do is unpack the animation HUD, keep it. Um. All right, so what you wanna do is unpack the animation HUD and then you will get which one you want i'll just do black so i'm gonna drop the hard on the floor so it's like really small so be careful you don't want to lose your animation hud because that would be annoying but yeah here's the hud right here oh. So, what you want to do is open it. So, you want to open it, scroll down, and then you will see Oracle right here. Then, this is where you will basically copy and paste all the animations that you got. I'll show you guys how to do that. So, first, what you want to do is transfer your animations into the HUD so we have running adult so I'm basically just transferring everything that I brought into the HUD I didn't buy that much I thought I brought way more I don't even know which ones I put now hold up I could have sworn I brought a type of one. So I'm gonna just redo it. Cause I got confused. So I put the running one, I put the stand one, the crouch, and another running one. I'm just confused because I thought I brought a type of one, but I guess I didn't. Oh here we go. So here's my type of one and the walking one so after you do that what you want to do is and 
then you could kind of see which ones you put in twice because it would say like crouch adele and then crouch adele one so i'm gonna just delete the second one i put in on accident and that's pretty much so what you want to do is add all the animations that you brought and transfer over to your hud and once you do that you click the add button and now what you would do is basically copy and paste you can actually rename it if you want to but i'm not going to do that for this video but yeah so for my standing i would go to stand one rename copy paste it my work rename copy paste it my run rename copy scroll down till you see run which is right here paste it type in rename copy paste it and we have crouching rename copy and paste it so what you want to do is like say you brought three more animations you would just stand period two click right here copy your other animation that you brought put it right over here you will paste it here your turns, your sits, your walks, your crouch, your typing, your jumps, your flying, your hovering, your falling, your standing up, swimming, stuff like that. But I only brought like four animations for this video. So yeah, it's really simple. And that's pretty much it. So what you would do is save it. Save it. Take it. Attach. The HUD and I'll just put bottom left so actually I'll attach it to the center and if you want to move it on the screen just edit and then use the move tool so I'm gonna turn it on turn this one off yeah I'm so mad so I copied and paste everything and please don't be like me once you copy and paste everything make sure you click save because I completely forgot to click save now I have to redo everything so I'm going to just redo everything real quick. So for my running, I actually have two running, so I'm gonna just go ahead and use this one. What else did I buy? My walk. So save it, exit out. 
take it, add it on, load it up. So now it is good to go. So we have the standard animation that I brought. Hola. Wagwan that together. Wagwan my youth. And you have the walking. So yeah, it's pretty simple. This is actually a low-key fire area. I don't even know how I got here. Okay, backflips. Um, so yeah, it's really simple. So what you wanna do is get your animations by the HUD and I showed you where to buy it at. Get as much animations as you like and set up your head like that but yeah if y'all have any questions if you feel like i didn't cover something feel free to leave your comment in the comment section and i will respond back to you i always forget to say this make sure you guys add me on instagram my main instagram is damian underscore joseph my gaming instagram is poppy finesse my in-world name is poppy finesse but yeah I hope this video helped make your custom AO process a lot easier and I will be back with another video soon but thank you for watching.